Hey guys, today I figured I'd make a video on how to get started with algo trading. I got this idea from a reddit thread where my response was pretty well received. I also got a good few subscribers from that, so thanks to anyone who subscribed from that thread. Anyways, this is going to be a bit on the beginner's side of things, but I feel it can still help those that are more intermediate. This is because I feel this field, if you want to call it that, it's both so shallow and so deep at the same time. Because everyone is off doing their own thing, not really communicating. Now, this isn't a bad thing either because you want to protect what you have, because what you have might give you an edge and that edge equals money and who doesn't like money? With this channel, I hope to maybe put a dent in things though, not disrupting individual progress, but taking the starting point a bit deeper. I don't think anyone including me has gotten where they are by just research alone. You have to build off what other people have put out. So where to start? Well, imagine algo trading as a tree. You see these people in their nice trees, they're growing apples, well in this case money, yeah. You decide you want to grow your own money tree? Well, sorry to say, but you can't really do that just by looking at other people's trees. You can't look at the branch, look at the leaves, and try to make your own tree from that. You have to start at the roots. The roots, in my opinion, are indicators, basic strategies, and just trading in general. Unless you're some omnipotent being that can just jump right into algo trading, you have to start manually trading first, just to get a feel of things. Not gonna lie, it's gonna take a while, I've sunk tons and tons of hours into it, and I still can't say I have a feel for things 100% of the time. You have to get into the zone, and well would you look at that, there's a book that talks about that. This book is regarded as one of the better books out there on trading. I've read it multiple times, I highly recommend it. I would actually read it after you trade a bit though, as a lot of stuff in there won't really resonate as you haven't experienced it yet. But yeah, you would have to start there, at the roots. You have to study individual indicators, what does an RSI do, why is it useful, take it apart and build it back up. Find some basic strategies, I have a github where I actually have some basic indicators from past videos. Next is the trunk. The trunk for me is more of the advanced maths, the more advanced understanding of things. I feel this is a good representation because I don't think anyone can have 100% understanding. So the trunk will be more solid, be able to grow more branches the more you know. But as long as you have a more advanced understanding of things, that will still work. You can still grow your apple. Unfortunately, it's hard to really say what advanced understanding is. It's something you just ease into. It's when stuff starts to make a bit more sense, when you realize why and how most things work. This doesn't mean you know exactly when to buy or when to sell, and on the contrary, this is where you realize position sizing, risk management, the Greeks, the other factors are much more important than you previously thought. You get to the state by planting the seed and working on the roots. I apologize again though because this is just really hard to give a solid answer here, as it's just all so broad. I could just list stuff, I could say calculus, algebra, but I feel like that's a bit of a cop-out. Just listing stuff like that. I want to give the most honest answer that I can, and the most honest answer is it's just really hard to define this. Moving on though, we get to the branches. The branches are very important, and I want to say the branches are like optimization. This is the final stretch, the polishing. A well-optimized algorithm will not only be able to produce more apples, but it'll reduce the amount of bad ones. Optimization, and I'm not gonna lie, it's both the best and worst part in my opinion. You have to be like a janitor telling your algorithm how to clean bad trades. It helps to keep things very simple when starting out here. The more complex your algorithm, the harder it will be to optimize. There's a delicate balance of underfitting and overfitting things. You just have to be somewhere in the middle. Alright, so now we know the tree, how do we actually start? Well, here's a little chart I made to hopefully help with that. TradingView is a great platform, you can load up pretty much any asset, experiment on it. It has PineScript and a built-in strategy tester. I would load up some strategies and just get a feel for it. There's also Investopedia which has great information on trading since these are the roots, you have to focus on manual trading and general trading knowledge. The trunk you might just have to work out for yourself, I'm sorry to say, because it's just kind of more trading view, kind of more research, just expanding upon the roots, basically. 
For the branches, it's also different for everyone depending on your strategy, but I would continue working in TradingView to try to see what you can rule out, try trial and error. If you're feeling exceptionally experimental, you can try machine learning. You're basically just trying to push your edge ever more in your favor. One tiny percentage point at a time. One line of code at a time. And as always, you just want to keep this simple. If you're looking for a crazy blunt answer, just load up TradingView, find a public strategy, and find out how it works, and then just build your own. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully by now you have a better idea of how to start out on the right path. If you have any questions though, feel free to contact me on Twitter. If you like this video and you want to see more stuff like this, feel free to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.